The Croton's bright colors can draw just a great amount of attention to any space it occupies. Though it has quite the reputation of being a fussy plant, in reality, Croton can be a resilient and hard-to-kill houseplant if the right care is given. Best Varieties of Croton to Grow Indoors Gold Star It has green leaves splashed with gold tones that can instantly add warmth to your home. Petra a popular cultivar with deep green leaves and veins in orange, auburn, scarlet, yellow, lemon colors are also known for its stunning bushy foliage. Eleanor Roosevelt Another popular cultivar with slender leaves in shades of lime green to burgundy dotted with bright yellow gives an impression of spray painted. Oak Leaf As the name suggests, it has oak leaf shaped bronze colored or dark green leaves with yellow, red and orange veins. Propagating Croton It is best done with stem cuttings. Take 6 to 8 inches of cutting from an actively growing branch by making a cut at a 45 degree angle just above a node. Dip the end in a rooting hormone and plant it in a pot filled with a quality potting mix. Water well and cover the cutting with a plastic bag. Place the container in a warm place at 60 to 80 degrees Fahrenheit. With suitable soil, temperature, water, and light conditions, the plant will grow roots in 25 to 30 days. What are the right conditions to grow Croton indoors? Right location. The sunlight is directly linked to the intensity of the color of the foliage. So to achieve a full, vibrant, stunning color, the plant should be placed in a bright, sunny spot. A south-facing window would be an ideal spot. Right soil. The tropical evergreen prefers well-drained soil with lots of organic matter. Any good quality potting mix designed for an indoor plant would work. Right watering. This tropical plant favors a humid environment and the soil should always remain evenly moist but not soggy. Keep an eye on the topsoil and water the plant when it feels dry to the touch. Right temperature. Native to tropical forests of Asia and Oceania, crotons like warmer climates and if temperatures drop below 50 to 55 degrees Fahrenheit, the leaves may start to turn brown. The ideal temperature for the plant's growth is 60 to 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Croton Plant Care Fertilizer A slow-release, balanced feed will give it all the boost for the plant's growth. Apply it once in four to six weeks for best results. Do follow the instructions on the label. Humidity Consider placing the plant on a petal tray to retain the right humidity levels. Misting crotons regularly can help avoid any infestation that might happen due to lower humidity levels. Pruning Crotons need trimming to when it starts to grow leggier and light pruning to get rid of the dead leaves. How to take care of croton in winter Crotons grow best in warmer weather, but they can hardly tolerate hard frost at all. You may also use a humidifier to maintain the humidity levels for the plant during winters. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for more interesting videos.